tonight at Reunion Arena or American Airlines Center. Christophs Porzingis, Brooke Lopez at center court for the jump ball, controlled by Bobby Portis from Milwaukee, and off we go. Dallas with wins in 28 of them, Milwaukee with wins in 32 of them, placing them third in the Eastern Conference. I heard you say Bobby Portis, watch that guy as a player, along with Drew Holiday and Brooke Lopez, be better. That simple. Luca bumps off the body of Lopez, a save and bounce by Holiday, right to Porzingis underneath for the look what I found. He regains his footing, looks to drive on Luca, has to take a very difficult angle baseline jumper. Portis there for the rebounded putback. Oh dear. He's good from that perspective as well as a rebounder. Big strong guy inside. Luca with the drive. And he got the nice roll with the foul. Just dominance. Just an incredible stretch. Didn't finish off the three-point play. Now Lopez cuts it down to a two-point game. Luca step back, Jack is good. <laughs> the man who makes tough shots look easy. Fade away in the lane, Middleton. Speaking of a player who has the ability to make shots with a high degree of difficulty as well. Some good rhythm for both teams early. Mavericks just 93 points last night and a nine-point loss. And good to see those three-pointers falling for Kleba. Middleton is 12th in the league in three-point percentage. Middleton missed it. Porzingis from Luka. And softly it rattles in. Playing in Milwaukee after four years with San Antonio. Pat Connaughton in the game. He had the defensive rebound. Lopez is straight away 17-footer. I, I mean, bigs that can shoot mid-range and three-pointers. When you start looking at guys like KP and Brooke Lopez, those guys are phenomenal shooters. Pass catch here for Porzingis. Right yeah, nice pass. Hardaway the assist. It's all going to depend on how Milwaukee does in the playoffs, whether or not that tree is good as Porter's in the right place at the right time. Rick calls a timeout. Things that you want to make sure you do as Forbes misses his three-point attempt. You want to finish the game well. Sure. I mean, it's one thing to start it well, but... Oh, Luca spins, fades, and over Portis. There's just not defense. Milwaukee has a foul to give in the last two minutes of the first quarter. Holiday. Kleba stays in front of him, forces a oh. tough bank shot. Good defense, better offense. Brooklyn and Philadelphia are the top two teams in the East. Milwaukee isn't completely settled into third place. Nobody's going to come up and catch them. Luca working against Portis. Several crossovers. Oh, he's got rhythm. Who could ask for anything more? <laughs> that was dominant. <laughs> Middleton inside to DiVincenzo for a three to break the tie. Melly restores the lead for Dallas, playing in a seventh game with the Mavs tonight. Hasn't made many threes, but just hit one. How about another one? Nico! Even Chinzo for Milwaukee. Just mentioned the long road trip they're on. They've got an above 500 record on the road, 14 and 11. And there's another one of those bombs from Brooke Lopez. Uh, when when Avery was coaching there and he'd yeah. come in town to play the Mavs, it was like Kevin McHale in terms of yeah, it was low tough. post stuff. Look at that right there. That's Kevin McHale, like right there, turn around using Dirks. It's been dropping here in the second quarter for the Mavs. Once again, Lopez, look at that move. <laughs> No he did it again. Sport. Like the fact that KP stayed down on all of the footwork by Lopez. Three in the lead for the Mavs, thanks to Porzingis. Lopez has switched on to Luca. Lopez, a good shot blocker himself. Luca took it into the paint, and what a pass! Richardson, no good, but a tip in by Porzingis. The activity on the glass will help you. Yeah. And guys, once again, as Portis floats it up, second try no good, third is with a foul. It was a tough free throw line jumper, too, with a challenge. Yep, fading away with a hand in his face as Steven Chinzo drains a three. Four points for a player who averages 20 a game. Drive by Luka, in the paint, put two more on the board for Doncic, he's got 11. Luka against Connaughton. Driving all the way to the basket. Someone was screaming, watch the step back about four times down there. 
Two fouls drawn already. DiVincenzo creeps out on Luka, extends his defense. So Luka got a round. Oh, and a zigzag drive in the lane leads to a hoop. Two All-Stars, Chris Paul and Devin Booker. Those guys making a lot of noise, and I don't think anybody expected it. Drew Holiday with a nifty finish against KP's defense. Savor the flavor of much of a lead of significance. Six points, the largest lead for either team. Dallas to go in front on the Luka step back three. It's a big bucket for Luka that time. With a lot of guys, four or five guys in double figures with Odette Kumbo being out. Nice play by KP. Oh, Porzingis driving. Hello. Pez. <laughs> Over Finney Smith to grab the rebound. I hope that's what Luka was saying <laughs> in the middle of the game. <laughs> and there's Middleton with his first basket of the second half and just his third in the entire game at 13 shots. It has to be. He's the second leading scorer on this team. And they're without their best player. Man. Luka splash down over Lopez. Best transition defense. They give up only 10 fast break points a game. Sign of a good team. Lopez knocks down a three. As a matter of fact, to give him his first two of the game. Brunson averaging almost 18 over the last seven games. On the board now here in the third quarter. And Middleton drains a three. Matter of fact, they've got that sought-after formula that a lot of people consider makes you a legit championship contender. Top 10 offense, top 10 rated defense as Holiday well. scores. Brunson leaves it for Hardaway. Corner three, biggest lead of the game for Dallas. Luca behind the back of the dribble. Deflected pass stolen by DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo eludes Luca. He finds Pat Connaughton. Connaughton all the way inside. Portis with a foul. And you, you have heard us say it once. We've said it so many times. Closing out quarters. Yeah. And Dallas surrendered a 12-0 run to Milwaukee here at the end of the third. 12-0 with DiVincenzo hitting at the end of the third quarter. Now those free throws have made this a 14-0 run. And there is the drought buster by Tim Hardaway. Foul coming here. Luca on the back down. Two defenders went to him. Luca got around round to Kubo and scored. Just to update the official number, by the way, it's 12 technical fouls this year on Luca. You are and suspended it, for a game at 16. I don't like that. That's a three by Middleton. I don't like that. Teague with a drive. Out to Portis. <laughs> and a so big flush. Cute. That was cute. Size well, advantage on T. Yeah. Portis came to help. He left KP. And he paid for it. You can't leave KP. Richardson. Oh, Porzingis ah. fell to him. Quick score, Middleton. Two point game. Very tough shot that time by Middleton. Foul was not overturned, so it's four fouls in the quarter. So next time, Dallas is shooting free throws, but no free throws right now as Luka just knocks down an in-your-face jumper up over the bigger defender, Brooke Lopez. Porzingis, long three, bucket! That's why he wants the ball. Don't Big worry. block by Finney Smith, came up from behind Middleton. He raced. To the cup, Connaughton. Luca against Lopez. Luca driving, finds Finney Smith, swings it over to Richardson. Connaughton, crazy closeout. Richardson calmly went under it and hits. That was pretty good in like 1932. He is a 49% shooter from the floor this year. It's, it's Richardson inside. Four seconds, Porzingis calling for it. Passes on the deep three. He'll kick it out to Finney Smith. Oh, and Finney Smith splashes it in. What a great contribution. Porzingis, Finney Smith, Richardson with a foul. Making 38 of them. And Nate Hinton will dribble out the clock on a win for the Mavericks and a really nice win.